we're asked to multiply 65 times 1. So literally, we just need to multiply 65, and we could write it as a time sign like that, or we could write it as a dot like that. But this means 65 times 1. And there's two ways to interpret it. interpret this. You could view this as the number 65 one time, or you could view this as the number 1 65 times, all added up. But either way, if you, if you have 1 65, this is literally just going to be 65. Anything times 1 is going to be that anything. Whatever this is, whatever this is times 1 is going to be that same thing again. If I have, if I have, I mean, you could think of, well, if I had just some kind of placeholder here, times 1, times 1, and I could even write it as the time symbol, times 1, that's going to be that same placeholder. That's going to be that same placeholder. So if I have 3 times 1, I'm going to get 3. If I have, if I have 5 times 1, I'm going to get 5. Because it's literally, all this is saying is 5 one time. If I get, if I put, I don't know, 100, and 57 times 1, that'll be 157. I think you get the idea.